and stuff. Oh, hello, my boy. No, don't mind me. I'm uh, just enjoying a lungful of bull durian. <laughs> yes, a distinctive aroma, though perhaps not one worthy of bottling. I hear you've been browsing in the most esteemed of emporiums, sorcerous sundries. <laughs> uh, indulge my curiosity. What wonders did you discover there? Perhaps it would have been better to keep that particular opportunity between ourselves. The crown of castles? No, Gail. It's for the best that I know. I trust there's no need to remind you what came of Cassus. His folly humbled a whole civilization. No one seeks an encore of that. Does she speak true, Gail? You? Truly believe yourself capable of wielding Carsus's crown? Perhaps she does. Would you begrudge me the chance to make things right, Elminster? Of course not. And the time has come for precisely that. Mistra knows you defied her, Gail. Well, of course she knows. She's Mistra. She bids you come to her holy shrine in the Stormshore Tabernacle. There, she will grant you an audience at last. There is only one reason why you should set your ambitions on such an item. To offer it over to Mistra as a token of your loyalty. Perhaps then she would overlook your earlier failings. But if you crave it for yourself, you would not just be failing her, you would be challenging her. Choose wisely, Gail. Do not trade one calamity for another. If you will not hear it from me, Hear it from your goddess. Uh, what truths she has to offer are for your ears alone. Gale of Waterdeep. <laughs> Godspeed. <laughs>